Welcome to our series of short videos looking at ideas from living economists. In this session, we're going to focus on the work of Muhammad Yunus. Muhammad Yunus is an economist originating from Bangladesh, who is often referred to as the world's banker to the poor. His work in creating and developing the idea of microfinance in some of the world's poorest countries was reflected in the award of the Nobel Peace Prize in 2006. Yunus originated the idea whilst a professor of economics at Chittagong University in Bangladesh around 40 years ago. Early loans were given only to women, many of whom had been effectively barred from access to credit from commercial banks because they came from families who were too poor to offer any form of security for a loan. So the key point here is that microfinance offers non-secured or non-collateralised lending to would-be entrepreneurs in poor communities, poor countries. Jonas believes that all human beings are born entrepreneurs. Some get a chance to unleash that capacity, but some never get the opportunity or knew that they actually had the capacity. And he argues there's a fundamental flaw with the current financial system in that there are very few opportunities for the poor to obtain the financial capital they need and which they can then apply productively. The problem has probably worsened since the start of the financial crisis in 2008. So Jonas founded the Grameen Bank, and that means Village Bank, in 1976. It promotes credit as a human right, and fundamentally it's targeted to the poor, particularly women. It's not based, as we've said, on security or collateral. It's based on trust or social capital, the idea that the, the borrower will pay the lender back at some point. The total interest in the loan cannot exceed the actual amount borrowed. Well, Green Bank has expanded rapidly across the world. The idea has been copied, refined and deepened in many low and middle income nations, as well as a cluster of cities in the United States and other advanced countries. For example, Grameen America has 18 branches in nine cities in the United States with over 60,000 borrowers. Here's a chart showing the expanding loan book of Grameen Bank. Professor Yunus has been vocal in arguing that high inequality is a key barrier to growth and that micro, uh, micro credit has a role to play in addressing this issue. In a recent article, he was quoted as saying that the widening gap between rich and poor around the world is a ticking time bomb threatening to explode into social and economic unrest if left unchecked. He argues that poverty is not created by poor people it's the system which created the poverty. And Yunus is quoted as saying, unless you change the system, you won't remove the poverty. For more on Muhammad Yunus, we suggest you Google Muhammad Yunus and Grameen Bank. And articles on his work can also be found in a special section of the Tutor to You economics blog.